I don't see how you can hate from outside of the club. You can't even get in. <laughs> Leg out. All right, guys. So we got a couple boxes. We posted up about it. So we're going to unbox and see what all's included in these new boxes. This one here is from our friends at BG Racing. <laughs> All right, so that's exhaust. We'll come back to that. We'll take that outside. Let's see what we got here. Okay, I got a couple of boxes here. I've got. All right, so that's gonna be our motor mounts for the EcoBoost from Steeda. We bought these through BG Racing as well. Yes, sir. So the main difference from the GT to the EcoBoost is that these are um, like triangular. There's three uh, mounting points, whereas the GT, I think, has only got two. So you have to buy EcoBoost-specific motor mounts. So as you can see, it's the whole plate, double side of bushings all beautifully machined out of billet all hardware and spacers are included it looks like um, my understanding is that this is the adjustable so my assumption is going to be that these spacers here are going to be the adjustment uh, based on what height you want um, now it's my understanding also that the black is considerably um, denser material so it's a lot harder so for race application this would be I guess more desirable but the NVH is probably going to be increased quite a bit so um, anyway so we got the motor mounts looks like it comes with all of the instructions I'm gonna assume that also comes with cap for yep right in there comes with the caps the factory motor mounts are actually vacuum assisted so we have to cap that part as part of the process so that's good because we were waiting on this to be able to get the motor sat down in the engine bay. So that is a big step towards old girl getting her heartbeat back. I'll probably be able to start working on that stuff today or this weekend at a minimum. And so that means this is going to be, well, let's look. So Ford Mustang, Ford Racing. This is going to be our hood struts, I bet. And that it is. Now we've already installed a set of these on Clifton's GT. Um, but the instructions were pretty straightforward. Um, this piece was a template that you can use to cut the battery bracket. Um, we modified that a little bit if I don't if I remember correctly. Ford performance. There they are. All right, so that's what uh, came in the boxes from yesterday. I believe that's all that's in there. Yep, looks like it's it. Okay, so we're still waiting on an E85 kit and also a new set of plugs for the motor. And we're also waiting on, what else? We've got the motor mounts here. We've got all the drive shaft stuff, which I didn't get to last night. Um, I was only able to get 
the brakes completed last night. Got the hood struts and hardware. Um, the only thing we're, oh, we're waiting on the HPFP. So that's all that should be coming left is the 85 kit and the high pressure fuel pump and the plugs. So um, old girl should be ready. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, just yank this out of here. CPE. Some hardware for it.